What is going on, Cubs fam? We are back for another Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes video. Mon Mothma is out there, and we are doing all kinds of testing, trying to figure out if she's good, what her place in this game is. And I'm going to tell you guys right now, it has been very challenging to figure this out uh, for, from where I sit right now. I do not have the team around her to do some testing. I've been heavily reliant on other people, even though I have her at seven stars. I think that if I just had my Rebel Fighters geared up a little bit more, I might be better off. But also Arena Shards, I don't have... Uh, I'm lowering my Arena Shard. Hard to get in touch with people down there to get some testing going on. And so... I do have some footage to share with you guys. Big thanks to Pimpo, who shared with us some footage that we're going to go over here in a little bit. That is, at a minimum, very encouraging for Mon Mothma owners out there. Speaking of Pimpo, check out a link down below in the description where you guys can find uh, some help with your mods on a service that he provides for the community. And I also got to say, speaking of shout outs, I just, <laughs> I'm a little bit slap happy tonight as I film this video. I want to give a quick shout out as well to my boy Fort Moore on Twitch um, I found this guy he says galaxy of heroes streamer I'm leaving a link to his stuff down below as well hung out with his stream for about an hour and just I, I can't describe it I just we were laughing I was I was like crying it was just what it was just a really awesome stream so go check him out if you guys want some late night um, r-rated uh, fun I should say all right let's get into the footage now I want to start by talking about a theory craft of kind of where I think Mon Mothma is going to be incredibly useful. Now, you're going to need to brace yourselves here, guys, because with the testing capabilities I have, this is Galactic War footage. I know. I know. I, I'm going to get so much hate for using Galactic War footage in a video, but there was no, there was just, no, there was nowhere else that I could use the team. There was nowhere else. So I'm not using this to show, hey, look, Mon Mothma beats Galactic War. How amazing. But rather, just look at the interaction, okay? Look at the interaction between Mon Mothma and C-3PO and how often these exposes are going to go out. You're going to expose this team left and right. And I think probably one of the bigger concerns that people had with Mon Mothma um, is the 90% damage reduction that you get on the assist now obviously you're getting a lot of assisting if you're using a full rebel fighter team which i'm not here obviously three bach is not a rebel fighter c3po isn't and i take out a little bit later in the footage we'll, we'll skip ahead i actually take three bach out thinking we need more rebel fighters in there um and then then you just see let's let's back this up just a little bit you just see how there's exposes left and right with all of those assists you're going to get those exposes out there they're going to stack on on each other and i think Based on what I'm seeing here, I, I really want to see it with a more flushed out Rebel Fighter team and against worthy competition that isn't gear eight characters with absolutely no synergy. I mean, which by the way, ca Capital Games, couldn't we just put good teams in there? I know that we used to complain about the difficulty to be a Galactic War, but it'd be nice if you just like, I don't know, just at least made them, you know, not gear eight. <laughs> but anyway, I, I, that's neither here nor there. Hopefully... Galactic Challenges gives us something that we can test against a little bit more, but that's, uh, anyway. The interaction here, though, with all those exposes makes me think that this is going to be very good. I am in the process of trying to get some real footage of this. Uh, for now, this is the best I've got to show just how often those exposes are going out and how awesome um, I, I think that is going to end up being. So, the biggest headline for this team for now is is that it does appear to be beating General Grievous. Now, the team that Pimpo is using here is uh, Mon Mothma with Pow, Wiggs, and Kara Dune. Um, really, I, I mean, I, I can't believe that they've, they've done it. They've actually, I, I think McMull too, has got to be just losing his marbles right now that they've done it they've made pow viable it seems and based on other reports i'm hearing hearing from other people who have been able to test but not record footage uh this does seem to be pow actually seems to be a legitimate character in this squad and having it work for now against grievous at a minimum is very notable to me um because the characters that you use with mon mothma 
are a bunch of characters that very few people are using right now. Um, it's probably pretty logical for you guys to have your bigs and wedge farmed up if you had a rebel fleet. You probably have them at at least gear 11, gear 12, maybe not a huge stretch to take them up to gear 13, or even just use them at gear 12. Uh, this is going to be a full gear 13 team, but taking them against a team like Grievous in Grand Arena and freeing up your Jedi Rev encounter, your Padme team or whatever, in and of itself has a ton of value um, if you are interested in Mon Mothma. And I think from a lore standpoint, I think Mon Mothma is just a desirable character that a lot of you probably went after just because it's Mon Mothma. If you're thinking about going for her though, I would say the jury is out on how much farther her, her viability is going to be. I've been wanting to see her against uh, Darth Revan. I've been wanting to see her against Jedi Revan. I've been wanting to see her against a bunch of other teams with full Rebel Fighter teams to see. Oh, you got to love that glitch right there. More bugs in the game. It's. I, I feel like this game has become Galaxy of Bugs a little bit, don't you guys think? Um, but anyway, the jury's still out on a lot of those other teams. Um, I'm going to, my eyebrows will really raise if, if she can do work against Darth Revan. And I actually feel like she might do pretty good against Darth Revan because she is uh, untargetable. If you put that uh, put that Zeta on her once you get that there, Darth Revan isn't going to be able to land that insanity on the leader. And that's that's really huge for the beginning of that battle. I think a lot of teams struggle against um, Darth Revan just because they start from so far behind. Here's another battle against Grievous. Again, unfortunately, the only team that Pimpo was able to get me footage of was against Grievous. I will be getting as, as much as I can for you guys. I cannot tell you how. <laughs> I've been working hard to try to find as much information about this team as I can. And this so far is the most concrete thing I am able to give you guys for now. And so if you're sitting there wondering to whale, to not whale, um, if you really want to feel like she's going to have more viability than just beating Grievous, I would hang tight for a little bit. Uh, let's, you know, let this bake a little bit more, wait for more footage to come in. I am working hard to get some of that to you guys and uh, we'll post as much as I can, as soon as I can, uh, so that you can be aware of that. But if you just want a fun extra character to use, I think she's going to be worth it. I'm personally really excited to have her. Um, I have no regrets whatsoever going for her, and so I'm pretty excited. This battle is obviously a little bit more from behind. That dispels really nice um, right there. They're going for a Droidica here. You got to love that. Pal I love how she, she's got like this Palpatine animation. It doesn't make any sense to me. Um, the survivability of the team is really notable against Grievous, I think. Uh, seeing them, be, you know, being able to take and survive that AoE there. Obviously, they did lose a character here, but uh, that's really solid. And then, of course, Mon Mothma has the revive. And so if you, you know, perfect the art of stalling harder, um, can be, uh, it can be very solid there as well. Um, so, all right. It looks like uh, is Pimpo not going to... He is going to go through the end of this battle. And you can see there, wrap it up against GG. Again, this is going to be comparable gear uh, tiers, so I think it's safe to assume that... Uh, if you're going against a full gear 13 relic 7 grievous team you're going to need to have that comparable gear um that still has yet to be fully tested but for now it definitely looks like mon mothma is at a minimum going to be worth your time if you just want a solid grievous counter let's go i'll, I'll go <laughs> you know what i'll do i'll throw up the rest of my amazing galactic war footage with my uh gear eight seven star mon mothma still waiting to uh star her up so a lot of theory crafting to do yet and a lot of other teams to test against um i will again keep you guys updated on everything that comes down the pipeline on that uh i, I think pro probably the the main central team that i would expect her to do absolutely nothing against is padme just because of all the assisting i she's probably going to be garbage against padme i don't expect her to beat galactic legends but be, this game is not just about beating the top meta team anymore because of grand arena adding uh, value here would be great and i'd like to see what she looks like on defense i think in theory she could actually be a pretty good defensive team to catch people off guard as well so 
Lots more testing to do, my friends. I hope you guys are enjoying the content lately. Um, again, a couple shoutouts in the video today. Go ahead and check those guys out down in the description below. Good stuff um, in this community. I just, I, I just want to say at the end of this video, this community never ceases to amaze me. The Galaxy of Heroes community is the best community, uh, get best gaming community I have ever been a part of. I just. I love you guys. Thank you so much for, for letting me be a part of this. It's just, it's so fun making content for you guys and so fun to see other people making content for this game and just seeing every, just, just all of it. You know what? We're just, can we just get a group hug up in here? I just, I love this game. I love this game. It's just awesome. So anyway, that's all I got to say. I just wanted to throw that at the end of the video. Thanks again for joining me for the video, my, for the video, my friends. I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, my brothers, don't forget, 